Hey everybody, CK here, and I'm coming to you guys with a really, really quick video only because it is like super duper early in the morning and I have to get out of here. And I'm sorry if there's noise in the background because everybody's getting ready to go. But I am gonna be trying these Anastasia new foundation sticks and I wanted you guys to be with me on like my first go around, okay? But I will tell you right now that <sighs> These things, they were very, very hard to pick, okay? I mean, I looked at videos on Anastasia's YouTube. I looked at videos on Anastasia's Instagram. I looked at swatches. I looked at all that stuff to figure out which color. And I'm telling you, I don't think I ever struggled so hard to find a foundation in my life. But I finally found a shade that I thought would match me. So I ended up picking Chestnut and Walnut. And to my surprise, when I got them, y'all, they were like really red. And on the models, they did not look that red. Well, I'll say Chestnut didn't look that red. So then they were launched in Ulta's, right? So I went to Ulta and I'm like, okay, maybe Almond is my color. So then when I got to Ulta, I'm like, let me try Almond because Almond may be my color. Like Almond, Caramel, and it was another color I thought. So they didn't have Caramel, but they did have Almond. So I tried it and um, no bueno. It was way too light. So... I really want to try this, give it a go around to see if it's even worth trying to find another shade. And I know they're coming out with a few more shades, but I'm like, we're going to try this out. We're going to try to make it work. And if I don't like the finish of it, if I don't like how it wears all day, I'm not going to even worry about it. I'll probably just like return these, but we'll see. So this color is Walnut and I will swatch it on my hand. But as you guys can see, that is really deep and that is really, it has a lot of like red in it and I don't have that much red in my skin. And so this color is chestnut. And that's what that looks like right there. So that is what we are gonna go with today. It is definitely not a perfect match. I already swatched it like on my neck and my face when I first got it. And I was like, man, this is not a great match. But I feel like I can get away with it if I like do some highlight and all that good stuff. But remember, this is my makeup during a weekday. So I'm not doing like a whole lot of extras, but I will do like a little highlight and that's about it. And I did not want to try this color on a weekend when I caught myself getting off live because I know it's not my exact color. You see? That is totally not my shade, but we're going to work it out. Oh my gosh. I need to move this. I haven't even looked up like the claims and all that kind of stuff yet. Seen a couple of videos, but I haven't looked up the claims because I don't even know if I want to keep it. I need to know how it feels. Forget what it claims. Okay, so far I don't need to spray any Fix Plus or anything, so. And look, I'm doing this without glasses or contacts, so. It better look right. It blends pretty good. Let's bring it down here a little bit. Oh, and these brows, I'm telling y'all, when I say they're five minute brows, oh my gosh, it is really red. Normally I will go in with even more foundation because y'all know I love foundation, but um, not on today. Mm -mm. So now I'm gonna go into my Too Faced Born This Way concealer and I'm just gonna use a shade dark, not really for a highlight, just to conceal actually you know what i'm gonna go with my other color too y'all i'm making do with what i have because i didn't wet a beauty blender this morning now i'm gonna take this mac corrector neutral corrector i think it is just go under here now i'm gonna use my black radiance powder have to use a powder with this because this is not gonna work out without a powder we're just gonna see if it's worth me getting another one so I'm gonna take my vlogging camera with me, you guys, and then I'll check in throughout the day, see how this baby looks in sunlight. Hey y'all, so I've had the foundation on for like about an hour, I guess. Maybe an hour and a, yeah, about an hour because I'm at work now and I'm about to get my day started. I mean, it's not too bad to be like an off color, you know? I'm trying to look up there to see what it's looking like. It's not too bad, but 
I um I don't want to really call this a first impression video this is kind of a first impression video and then it's kind of like a try before you buy type situation although I bought it I'm trying to see if I want to buy it again to get my actual shade you know what I mean I'm trying to figure out if I want to go through the hassle of finding my exact shade like is it really something I have to have you feel me I mean because $25 is not bad at all but the hassle of finding your color is like man right but for now, I mean, it looks really, really natural. I mean, aside of it not being like a perfect match. So I do see a little bit of oil coming through like right here. And, you know, my pores is looking a little, it's looking a little like, you know, it's showing up a little bit. And I don't know that I like that. But I did not use a mattifying primer or my Becca primer that's also like pore perfecting. I did use my Lancome, which is supposed to be like a pore eraser as well. And it usually works really great. But I don't know if it's working with this. Like, let me see. You see that? So I don't know. But I will say that it does feel very comfortable and it does look pretty natural even though it's not my exact match. But I will check with you later on throughout the day. I'll try to do like multiple check-ins, but it totally depends on how my work day goes. But if I don't see you throughout the day, I definitely got you at the end of the day. And I'm gonna try my best not to blot even if I feel the need to, okay? All right, y'all, so I'm at my P.O. box. This is the only moment that I had to come to y'all real quick before I get on with the rest of my day. But I've had this foundation on since 7 a.m. this morning, and it is 4.41 p.m. And I almost want to say that um, it ended up marrying my skin. Um, no. So I thought. But looking at the footage right now, no bueno. Check out more of my thoughts in the description box, okay? So now I really don't know if I want to get another shade because I'm wondering if it's going to be too light. Like, I don't know. I may play in this a little while. You know what I mean? Let me take these glasses off. But like, look, you see close up? Oh, my lordy. Ooh, I'm showing all my business. I don't know how I feel about these brows today, though. But um, there you go. Now, the pores are not looking so bad. But then again, I don't have my glasses on. Now, it kind of gave me like a dewy finish overall. I'm looking at my viewfinder. But that, like, not highlight, but it kind of looks like a highlight. That blush is popping. But it's not super de duper oily, you know what I mean? To have had it on since 7 a.m. And it's now, like, actually it's almost 5 p.m. I totally need to get, like, some type of stand for this camera when I'm in my car. Because it seems like I've been doing a lot of these lately. But I have to blot because life will just be so much better once I blot. And I haven't blot. Whoa. I told you I love these type of napkins. This is what I blot with. But I haven't blotted all day long. And you guys, I know this is like super informal, but listen, I did not want to try this foundation without you. I wanted you to be present and I was tired of letting it sit there. I'm like, I want to try it already. All right. That's not too shabby. I may come back on one more time at the end of the day at the end of the day if not you guys let me know if you like videos like this and i will continue to do them because i didn't want to like hold off i wanted to do my thing but i wanted y'all to be with me so let me know if you like the video don't forget to thumbs up and thank you guys for watching i appreciate all your support i thank you for the likes i thank you for sharing my videos y'all rock y'all are awesome and have an awesome and blessed day and i will see you sooner than you think it may be later tonight, and then it may be in the next video. We shall see.